Hello boys and girls, my name is Alsas T and welcome to the first real episode of FTL Season 1. Uh, we have chosen uh, uh, this ship here and uh, let's uh, uh, dive in. So uh, we are here in the uh, first sector and it can happen that uh, I get uh, destroyed and that would basically mean end of uh, the series but the goal is to get to the end with uh, with uh, each ship so uh, there is a lot to come so first things first we have to sort out our um, energy and our weapons. You can see we have uh, uh, three uh, power bars to spare uh, that allows us uh, to power all the weapons. This is a laser, a pretty good one, requires two powers and uh, has three shots. And then we have a mis missile, missiles uh, ignore shields, as you can read there, uh, but they uh, require missiles uh, for each firing. And uh, of course, there are uh, countermeasures that might uh, decrease the uh, efficiency. Uh, what else do we have here? We have shields. Uh, on the basic level, then engine. Uh, we have uh, two engine bars, but uh, only uh, uh, sufficient energy for one. We have the med bay, which is powered. We have oxygen supply, which is powered. Then we have uh, our uh, weapons. And over here, we have subsystems that don't directly need power. Uh, but they can be uh, upgraded later on. This is the, the door system uh, to open and close the doors. Uh, then the sensors to see what's going on your ship and uh, yep. And then we have uh, uh, piloting which uh, also can be uh, upgraded. But for now let's uh, deactivate the, the med bay and give that power to the uh, engine and this gives us uh, I think uh, yeah plus five percent uh, evasion and let's go to the first mission so in the end we have to reach the uh, exit and on the way we should uh, um, touch as many systems as possible and the uh, enemy or the enemy front will move in from the left side so we have to stay uh, in front of it so uh, basically uh, cover all the uh, uh, star systems from the left to the right and going through nebula this will actually slow down the uh, enemy front so nebula uh, are are good for that okay let's head here and see what's in store here so we have a plasma storm uh, which basically drains half our uh, energy which can be bad if you have to fight uh, for a ship but uh, here we only get the uh, the option uh, to search for a ship which i think could do some uh, damage to us but uh, generally speaking i think it's a good idea to do it yeah damage but we we got some some more fuel we got uh, five extra rockets and uh, seven scrap that's that's the thing above here and with the scrap uh, we can uh, later on buy uh, uh, upgrades so on to the next sector and another nebula 
and let's pause Ooh, intruders okay early on um, this can be a bit difficult but if you have a med bay um, the easy thing is to do it like that so uh, let's click this dialog away and then quickly uh, pause the game so the intruders are in oxygen this is here so let's grab all our uh, crew move it into uh, here um, and then we will open all the doors except for the ones into the med bay and uh, because of that they should follow us into the med bay and we can fight them here and while we are uh, healed up the enemy is not and uh, it's an easy win for us and we can close the door again now that we have them uh, where we want them and uh, that will uh, increase the uh, oxygen levels again and then let's return to the stations and uh, let's wait for the uh, oxygen to replenish a bit more uh, we can also reset uh, our systems and you can also see here in the nebula um, you don't get any benefit from the uh, sensor so that's a bit of a downside okay let's move on if we go up here we can head down back to the nebula again okay it's an unmanned uh, scout ship uh, we have to fight it um, looks like he has a beam weapon and uh, some sort of um, uh, stun energy weapon that will uh, drain energy from the hit system and if we have shields up the system will be uh, shields so basically um, we have to uh, get uh, the weapons down as fast as possible because uh, with these two weapons they can penetrate uh, our shields yeah so it's uh, an iron cannon and a hull thingy Ooh. and we have uh, a leak here um, so here is what we will do um, rocket into the shields and then we should be able to uh, fire the lasers to the weapons Ooh, nice the the iron mist but me we missed as well but as this one uh, uh, fires three bullets beams whatever um, nicely done and uh, from here on out they basically uh, uh, cannot hit us so uh, we don't need to waste any uh, any rockets and can just use the laser and his toast and we get a bit of um, goods and uh, let's quickly uh, fix fix this leak here before it gets worse then we probably need to heal him up who too close for comfort 
and maybe you have seen during the fight um, the the crew get uh, skill levels uh, for example uh, piloting is uh, if a shot is uh, evaded same as uh, as engine um, and uh, for the uh, uh, weapons it's basically uh, weapons get fired shields is uh, shields get uh, hit Okay, and another scout, uh, another uh, uh, iron beam which has uh, uh, multiple layers, so um, uh, they can uh, hit multiple time, and beam weapon, and he is trying to uh, to get away. So I think we will do this. Okay. And uh, that should sort that out. Yep, that was an easy one. And final nebula system in here. Okay, I can try rockets for uh, uh, draw it. Uh, yep, I will do that because uh, I don't like to rely on uh, on uh, rockets. So. The first thing uh, uh, we can uh, swap this weapon out um, is good. So we're next to Han. It looks like either, and he here you can see this is the uh, enemy front closing in. So if we go down, we cannot go up. So let's try going up. It's a bit more uh, store systems. Okay, so they only have a beam weapon, but I would guess they have some uh, some kind of uh, drone that could hurt us and they try to get away. Oh, a beam drone! So basically they can hit us so um, let's first uh, fix that then the shields had a bit of trouble there because uh, not all the shield hits were hits. Yep. Needed a missile but we got uh, uh, two back. And we slowly but surely we're racking up on the uh, scrap. So um, if we have a look at here, we can do the uh, upgrades. And basically, usually one of the first you want to do is uh, second shield level, which is uh, you need two of two bars here. So. Um, 20 plus 30 is 50 and then you need two energy um, which adds another 40 so um, you need 90. And we have a store here 
but that's on the on the downside so I will ignore that for now okay we will investigate the uh, battlefield and we stumble up on an enemy cruiser so here a beam weapon firing one shot and a combat drone also firing one shot um, the problem with these if they are uh, luckily or unluckily uh, aligned they can uh, fire um, two shots in uh, quick succession so let's use one here and then the drone okay they want surrender usually surrender is uh, seldom a good um, option so uh, as a rule we don't accept surrender I don't remember what the, the offer was but I think it was uh, one one and then some so let's fix the sensors and up here you can see uh, we have taken some damage but uh, usually I'm not that fast uh, uh, until it goes into the uh, middle yellow section should we? No. Nothing here. And there was a, a distress, which can be good or can be bad. But I think more often than not, it's uh, it's a good thing. So they have a beam and uh, a hull laser. okay that's bad they hit our weapons and uh, due to the fact that they are uh, not uh, equally synchronized uh, only the first shot usually can uh, can hit us because then uh, our shield will be regenerated uh, uh, until the uh, uh, beam is uh, is powered oh there was a fire so uh, shields are wrecked now um, this is quite good um, Stealth weapons I don't care for. We could sell it. We would get maybe a, a 20 for it. Hmm. I guess if they uh, have so a high bribe, maybe they have more. I would be more interested in scrap. No, they have less. Should have taken it. Okay, and on to the next one. Okay. Uh, this is a station, so a station can give us scrap information or uh, some other things and yeah that's what I meant okay 
So one problem solved, then let's focus on the shields next. And why is it always that my sensors are targeted? And done. Yep, a little bit of scrap, not too much, but that should be enough for our uh, shield upgrade. So we will hold out on that one. Oh, there you see. Uh, we have uh, uncovered uh, the complete map so uh, the stores are down there so um, we will not get by uh, a store so uh, we can as well uh, buy our second shield and that should help us Ooh, giant spiders. No, thank you. Um, I don't know how the um, the likelihood is, but usually uh, you lose a crew member there. So I will uh, pass that one. Okay, um, surrender. You try to get away, you don't have any good weapons, I think that's uh, anti-drone, uh, drone, so pretty useless as we don't have any drones. Yes! Just before they got away. Ooh, fire suppression, that's that's actually quite good because it helps uh, putting out uh, uh, fires. And some more scrap. Okay. Last one before the exit, so nothing excited, but... Uh, some more free stuff and exit. Hmm. I don't care for the missiles, and the scrap is not good, so. Um, Let's fight them. Okay. They have um, uh, some iron drone, uh, iron weapon, and a uh, normal laser. But they also have mind control, which could be uh, a bit troublesome. But at least they uh, cannot uh, hit our shields. So let's try to get this out of the way. Really? Okay. They have really good evasion, but uh, if uh, you hit the uh, piloting, 
equation is down to zero. Or if you take out the well, this one is better, but uh, um, only on uh, these parts, and I have uh, enough fuel. Well, let's take it. Okay, and with that we are off to the next sector. And here you see the uh, sector overview for the first time. In the end we have to get here. These ones are nebula sectors, the green ones are civilian sectors, and the red ones are hostile sectors and that's a bit of an indication uh, uh, what species uh, are living there um, so usually what I try to do is I tend to go green um, but I uh, also like to, uh, to have uh, uh, options uh, where I have uh, two different uh, colors. So for this one I think we will go abandoned sector because uh, uh, sector 2 abandoned sector is pretty good. You don't want to have that uh, in, the, in the last sector. So I hope you enjoyed this first episode of FTL and I will see you tomorrow in the next one. Bye!